r slash ask credit. What's the worst name you ever heard? Pubert. Number duck I'm Pubert. Hey guys I'd like you to meet the newest member to the family. Pubert Haywood. Here in Hong Kong. Kinky ho. The best kind of ho. I prefer my ho with another couple of hoss. Merry Christmas. Joe I Joe Joe Jr. Shabadoo. Nine year old account. Hori shit. It's him. Boys. My mom is a teacher. Last year she had a student named Des. Like just the letter. It's pronounced as when saying the letter not its sound. I really don't know. Somebody enjoyed Death Note far too much. Only live action fans would actually name their kid a letter. My mum works in a school and there was a girl named Saggy. Well that name will fit in approximately 60 years time. Parents playing the very long game. Austin. That's awful. FWCKI still registered this as awful, as if the W was still there. Purvis. As someone who grew up with the second name Purvis. I can vouch for this being entirely awful. I had a teacher many years ago with that surname and honestly it took me a while to fully understand it in his English accent. I never actually picked up on the whole Purvis sounds like pervert thing. I can honestly say he was probably the best teacher I ever had, and that I maybe wouldn't even be where I am today without his help. In China it's normal that Chinese people, which study English or work in an international company with a lot of foreigners, give themselves an English name. In the last 10 years they shifted to just English words. The best one so far was a name. Which according to its owner sounds really cute. A name? Syphilis. She wasn't aware of the meaning. My other half worked with someone calling himself exactly. Nice pun tbf. Fruitopia and baby girl. Yes. These are actual names written on people's birth certificate. Edit. Copied from my second comment below. No I was listening to a podcast and they had callers call in to speak about the topic which was what's the worst name you've heard? And a woman who worked in Childka said a woman who used to drop her kids off at the daycare named her children Fruitopia. Baby girl. And fear Pronounced fire. And I couldn't breathe for like 20 minutes I was laughing so hard. I hate people who name their kids stuff that implies that they are babies slash little children. It's like the parents are so mentally challenged that they don't even remember that the whole point of having a child is that they grow up and are real people that will be real adults at one point. TBH. Many parents don't have kids because they primarily want them to grow up. So it's no real surprise they name them after characters from Chinese copies of Disney films. Dildema. I teach English as a second language in China. Some of my students have legitimately chosen the most random names you could imagine. Now I don't have a issue with someone choosing a random name as a way to show off their unique personality, but when you have Kiki Baby, Batman and New York all in one class, my job becomes extremely difficult because I have to keep myself from bursting to laughter. Edit sorry when I originally posted this, I didn't think it would ever be noticed just like all other posts. Sorry about the typus I had just woken up. So like how Americans get random as Chinese tattoos. Except more ridiculous. I've seen a guy with chazzy yes. Tea leaves on this arm. I live in New Zealand. Where the internal affairs office places restrictions on what people can name children. Largely it's along the lines of no titles as first names. And nothing that would cause detriment to the child's future. In saying that. I also work at a job where we see a lot of people's details come through every day. Here are my picks. Princess, because they couldn't name her princess. Furious, boy. Chiquita. Tequila. Unique. Jador. Diamond. Sapphire. Amethyst. Courage and Serenity. Twin boys. Wiki. Hallelujah. Also. A few years back a couple tried to name their daughter for real. But it got rejected. And then there was one unfortunate child named Taluladas the Hula from Hawaii. More as I think of them. And then there was one unfortunate child named Taluladas the Hula from Hawaii. I realize we won't ever find out because she deserves her privacy. But I'd love to know what name she chose. Pretty sure it was Anne's. Edit. I know I've read that it was in some time since 2008. 
but whether or not it was reported and then taken down or not I don't know. Because I sure as hell can't find anything to back me up now. Sorry about that. Probably the classic V Ireland that became viral last year. Just to make all of your lives easier. It's just Caitlyn. But the 8 is replaced by the Roman numeral 8. I wouldn't be surprised if K87L1N was on someone's birth certificate. Then. Too. But seriously. If this is true that's by far the dumbest one in this thread. P vertical bar vertical bar 55 it 357 R0 Y3R. I knew not one. But two women named Cinderella, and I felt sort of bad for them. I knew a girl called Cinderella. At least it wasn't Cinderella. I moved city to be with my girlfriend. She's told me about a couple who had a little girl called Blessing. Okay right. A couple years later they have another daughter. The name, more Blessing. Blessing 2, Electric Boogaloo. Blessing 2, Electrox Hallelujah. Bought. Are you talking to me? No, my son is also named Bort. I once met a girl named Papaya. So introduced myself as Mango. She wasn't amused. That's kind of a cute name. Yeah. For a cat. Lol the post above this was titled What kind of psychopath spells Michael as Machiel? My Dutch buddy Machiel would like to have a word. In my language Michael becomes Machiel. It sounds like Michael. Source, I'm Italian. My name is Mitchell. I'm not even joking. I was once waiting to get on the train and this woman saw her kid running off, so she called him back by the name of Motorcycle. Should have gone with Bachil. Hi my name is Michael with a B and I've been afraid of insects my whole life. A friend of mine named her child Dizzy Dot. No joke. I know a Dizzy. I know a Dot. I do not know a Dizzy Dot. It is a good thing people can change their names. Miracle Wang. Went to school with a Reich Chow. Alexander 13 a kid from my junior school simultaneously the best and worst name I've ever heard. He's a protagonist for sure. He eventually will be. Once 12 is done. Themisticles a lib bang bang. No. I will not call you Tim. Probably Themisticles. Festicles. Cranjismic basketball. Tony Gunk agrees with you. Poo poo. Legit. That was her legal name. I worked with a woman called Pai Pai in the 1990s. My manager couldn't pronounce it properly and called her Poo Poo. My guess would have been Pew Pew. Some woman named her newborn new god. I mean at least name him Reaper or Ghostface. You god. Really? Right. Method Man was right there. Sunday Bigfoot and I'm not even kidding. Kirrington McKine Lake Abrin Sparks. Did, did you have a stroke while typing this? For your sake I hope not. But for humanity's sake I hope you did. Unfortunately I didn't. Google it. She exists. And she has siblings. Spijka, which means nail in Dutch. Haha. <laughs> I know a Dutch guy named both. Which roughly translates to criminal. Is he an incompetent rapper as well? Used to work in customer service. Had two amazing ones. One was genuinely called Unicorn Unicorn. This person passed a credit check to get a phone contract, so it was genuine. The other was a lady called Mrs. Ike in bottom. And yes. She insisted I not use her first name. I just didn't use her name whatsoever. Maybe her first name was Anita? Guy called Wayne Bruce. So his nickname was Manbert. Heard of a Glaswegian taxi driver called Campbell Baxter. Nickname, Two Soups. Bird's ass. Say it out loud. It basically doesn't matter what the first name is. Misty. Short for mistake. When my grandma was in her twenties. She babbisat the five kids of an alcoholic. The drunk Ish named her fifth kid Mistake and everyone kindly nicknamed her Misty. All five of those kids would often just show up at my grandma's house for food because their mom wouldn't come back from the bar for days. If it was just Misty it wouldn't be that bad tbh. She'd become a gym leader. 
have a friend who lives in Spain. After mastering pronouncing R's the English way as her husband is called Rob she called her dog Rory. Just to watch her neighbors struggle with the R. Chaotic evil. Prune, girl. Lucky for her she was pretty. That's going to be terrible when her looks fade. She ages and looks like a prune. Bad son. Son of bad man. No. Bad son is Shazam's alter ego. Silly. B0B. Yes spelt with a zero. You can spell names with numbers. Bzerab. You vav wev wev one year ten year wa you bemab wamosis. You woo. There's this girl on the local radio station sometimes called Twilight Compost. I believe. Noel but it was spelt J-K-M-N-O-P. Because there is Noel. Don't do that again PLS. Went to college with a woman named Anita Cox. I went to college with a girl named Toy Cox. Who in the right mind would name their kid Toy if their last name is already Cox. At least with Anita it takes a little while for the bullies to figure out how to mock her with it. I need to. Mighty. Number 9 or the armadillo? Lettuce. Poor little boy came into the store I work with his mum and mum's friend who both looked like crack addicts and kept running off so they kept calling out lettuce. Thought they said Curtis so when I saw the boy walking around I asked him Curtis are you looking for mum? Mother responds it's lettuce. I have thought this many times in this thread but WTF makes people have this line of thinking? And why lettuce? Why not asparagus? Like what made them settle on lettuce?